soak the corn in water for about two hours or more so it steams on the inside when you're roasting it. You want a hot fire and I just, you know, get it so you're starting to look, see it's toasting on the outside. But it's going to give you a, a nice, uh, we'll show you later, but it's going to give you a nice little grilled effect on the inside while it's steaming. Corn's done, fire's still hot, not super hot, the coals are white. So I just put the wahoo on. These steaks are probably an inch and a half, maybe inch to inch and a half thick. Marinating for two, two hours. Um, after an hour in, I flipped the marinade in a plastic bag, actually, so you don't waste the marinade. But anyway, so we put the uh, steaks on the grill, poured a little of the marinade over the top of it, and I'm gonna go ahead and put my cover on it. And just let that sear bake for maybe five minutes and then I'm going to flip it. Be careful not to overcook it. That's the main thing. It's, um, it's, a, it's a delicate balance of searing and just cooking it at the right temperature without getting it, you know, too grilled. It probably takes a total of 10 minutes to cook the fish. And these are, these steaks started out an inch to an inch and a half thick. And then we're going to go ahead and plate it up with our cherry salsa. Mm -hmm. 